What's going on guys? It's your boy Dipsy and I'm back again finally man. Feels like I've been out of commission for a little bit but nah I'm back again. Just been so busy with all my work obligations I wasn't even able to get a damn video out so you already know that was breaking my heart inside. <laughs> but I'm not even gonna play the small violin for you guys. Actually uh, I changed my mind. But anyways Without further ado, I'm going to be bringing you guys the delayed texting strategy. But before I even explain that, I think I need to hop into my YouTube gangster attire. So without further ado, dun da da da, dun da da da, dun da da da. Boom. Now I'm back in this shit like I never left. Let's get to work, guys. Now, understand. The delayed texting strategy is a, it's a phrase that I coined, guys, because through my observations of texting people, I've noticed certain patterns. That's, here, that's why I'm here to bring you guys this information. Now, understand this, guys. When you are texting someone, you have to be cognizant of the fact that the speed at which you send your text matters on a subconscious level. I don't care how many memes you guys see, oh I love fast texters, oh I love when, when she texts me fast and when he texts me fast. Listen guys, subconsciously the human brain is operating at this level. When people see you making hella noise when I gotta record bro, shut up, damn. But anyways, the human brain operates on a certain level so slow text guys. If you send a text every one hour, every 30 minutes, at a slow rate, subconsciously, even though that may be annoying to the person that you're texting, you are signifying that you are high value. Why? Because a person is naturally going to question, why is this person texting me so damn slow? They must be a busy person. So anytime they get a text from you, instantly that text is going to hold more weight simply because it's not coming in as frequently so when you do text it's more important just how if you're a fast texter you are signifying that you are of lower value and guys listen i'm explaining this stuff but don't by any means think i like this shit i don't make the rules i'm just here to really explain the phenomenon of why you guys might text a girl or you might text a dude and you're responding hella fast and you know, your common sense is going to really tell you, hey, I'm responding hella fast, like, like, this is dope, they should like that. But no, guys, I'm here to explain to you why you're responding so fast and you might get dubbed and not know why. So, guys, continue. Fast texts, like I said, are showing that you are somewhat needy. They are showing that, hey, I've got a lot of time on my hands, that's why I'm able to text you. And the funny thing about this is you don't necessarily have to have a lot of time on your hands to text someone fast, guys. A lot of the time it takes, what, like five to six seconds to send just about any text. Like, especially with the, uh, you guys know what I'm talking about. You just swipe to the different letters. You can send a text in like 0.5 seconds. But the whole game is, guys, as sad as it is to say, you might want to, even if you have the time to text someone, you might want to use the delayed texting strategy to make yourself look like you're of higher value. And you're going to tend to use this strategy in the beginning stages when you're getting to know someone because they have very limited information on you. So they're more likely to judge you based off of like superficial stuff like this, like how fast you text. Uh, your Instagram bio, your profile, your pitch, all that stuff. So guys, this strategy is most effective when you first start talking to someone. Um, now guys, the delayed texting strategy isn't always a thing if you are actually busy. If you are actually putting your mind towards something important, you'll naturally use this strategy without even having to think about it. Like. If you are working long shifts, you come home and then you're also working on your passion in the spare time, you'll naturally just start texting people slower and they will think you're of higher value simply because of that. Now, for, all, for anyone who might think I'm lying, especially my guys, 
Think about all the times you've texted a girl really fast. Now think about the favorable results you've gotten from that. And now I want you guys to think about the times you've texted her really slow. I bet you she was checking on you more. I bet you she was texting you faster after that. And why? You might just want to chalk it up to the delayed texting strategy. Now if you guys enjoyed the video, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I'm going to be dropping lots of content hopefully. I'm going to get my schedule figured out and I'm going to find a time to push out these videos for you guys because I love talking about social phenomenon such as this. Anyway, it's your boy Dipsy. I'm going to catch y'all later, man. Peace out.